12,000 pesos for a shoes? Let's go! Morning. Minabasa ako sa internet, you guys. Sabi nila kapag uminom daw tayo ng tablespoon ng apple cider vinegar in the morning, like early in the morning before you take anything, it will, you know, activate your stomach enzymes. Something like that. So ito yung apple cider vinegar na inumin natin. Spectrum Organic Raw and Pasteurized Apple Cider Vinegar. Yan, guys. So that's it. Take one. A tablespoon. Mm. Ako guys, you know what? In any dishes that I eat, I like adding vinegar. For some reason, I just like the taste of vinegar. Pero ito nga pala sa inyo, kaganina nagluto si Mama ng... So yan, I'm not really sure if this is jambalaya, may mga carrots. This rice is from yesterday. Sabi niya sa akin, initin ko daw kasi uuwi na siya from work. So let's... Actually, let's add an apple cider vinegar to it. Tingnan lang natin. Let's see... Let's just add a little bit. Then let's also add spice to it. Yeah. Just a tiny bit. Let's turn it on. Let's wait for five minutes. Mmm. Alright. We're gonna add some eggs, two eggs. Two. Sa Pilipinas, guys, I believe may mga shawarma rice, di ba? Also yung mga shawarma rice. Nung college ako, guys, yun yung kinakain ko. Kami nung ate ko kasi mura lang. Affordable. I believe that time nasa 50 pesos siya or 40 pesos. I'm not sure now kung magkano yun. Mga budget meals for students. So let's just wait for this to cook. Hinaan lang natin yung apoy guys para hindi masunog yung kanin. So night shift pa nga pala tayo. It's already what? 9 o'clock in the morning. We still have few hours before we go to duty. So let's wait for another 5 minutes. 5 minutes. I feel like it's done already. Tingnan natin. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> dry na dry guys. So I'm just unpacking my stuff. Ito yung mga dinala ko sa Pilipinas, guys, na mga damit. I came here a week ago and um, tinatamad kasi akong linisin tong mga gamit ko. Ibalik sa cabinet kasi wala pa ako sa mode, guys. I'm still on vacation mode. <laughs> Kaya hindi ko pa siya naibalik. So ngayon ko pala siya titikipin. Uh, ito hindi ko to naipakita sa inyo. I like buying clothes from Zara, you guys, because aside from the fabric being comfortable, ano siya? Because I find it hard to look for a size that fits my body well because for some reason, my body proportion is like really weird. My head is big and my body is so small. So, yun. This one, this pants I got from Uniqlo, you guys. You know what? I love clothes from Uniqlo for some strange reason, even though the designs are very minimal, but I like it. I love Ninong Michael. Papakita ko sa inyo guys, ang sweet from Ariana Zoe. Inaanak ko siya. Hello Ariana! Ayan guys oh. <laughs> Nurse pa yung outfit ng keychain and nakalagay pa yung pangalan ko dito. I love Ninong Michael. So it's 8 o'clock na. Yun guys, so um, ano ba? 8 o'clock na, 11 pa naman yung pasok ko. So ang dami pa natin magagawa. Plano ko talaga is magigising ako ng 9 pero nagising ako ng 8. Ganun ako guys, pag nagising ako, it's difficult for me to to catch that sleep again. So, nakailang pikit na ako pero hindi na ako makabalik sa, sa tulog. So, ano bang gagawin natin? Ano bang sinabi ko ganina? Ayun nga pala, ipapakita ko sa inyo yung mga pagkain na binili ko sa Pilipinas. Mga pasalubo ko dito kay Mama Chaka sa sa pinsan ko at sa tita ko. So, nandito yung pinamili ko guys. Ayan. Obviously, hindi mawawala ang pulburon na paboritong paborito ng mga Pilipino. Ito, pulburon pa dito. Cashew pulburon. 
Tapos ito, binili ko to nung Christmas sa Pilipinas sa Mall of Asia. Assorted flavor siya ng ano. Anong tawag mo dito sa mga pag... Sa sweets na to. So, iba't ibang klaseng nasa loob niya, guys. Hindi pa namin nabubuksan. And obviously, syempre, may sampalok. Then, ito, anong tawag mo dito? Peanut nougat. Sugar, peanuts, butter, and salt. Naubos na, guys. Actually, bumili kami ng mga limang supot nito. Ito, ang titira na lang is apat. Galing tong Laguna, you guys. Nung umuwi yung tita ko ng Laguna. Because my tita is from Laguna. Binili niya to apas. My favorite, you guys. Goes very well with uh, coffee or Milo or yan. Kasi hindi siya sweet. I mean, like, it's sweet but not too sweet. So, meron kami dalawang apas. Yan. Thank you, Nay. Ito, I'm not really sure kung familiar kayo dito, guys. Puto seko. Pag kinain mo siya, para siyang... Anyway, basta yun, guys. Puto seko. Aware ba kayo dito? Alam niyo ba to? Yan, from Laguna. So, yan. More sampalok. Tapos ito, syempre, hindi mawawala ang otap na paboritong-paborito ni Mama. Sugar biscuit, you guys. Madami siyang flavor eh. Meron pa actually dito. Anong flavor to? Anong flavor to? Ube. Ayan no? Ube. Tapos ito, I'm not really sure kung flavor niya. Meron kami nung isa panda na ubus na. Yun yung pinakamasarap. Ano pa ba? Actually, yun lang eh. Yun lang. Yan. And then, yun lang. And guys, I'm not really sure if you're aware. Pero dito sa UAE, it's very cold right now. I'm not really sure kung ilang degrees. Siguro mga 12 or 13. Ang lamig guys. Ang lamig. Pag lumabas ka ngayon, sobrang lamig. Hindi pwedeng wala kang sweater. Nung nga sa Pilipinas ako guys, I was thinking of buying this sweater from Uniqlo. Pero sa sobrang busy, sa sobrang daming ginawa, na wala na siya sa isip ko. So, tinex ko yung pinsan ko na si Ting Tang sa Pilipinas na sana mabili niya tong red sweater from Uniqlo. I've, gusto kong i-insert sana dito yung picture pero I've tried searching the image from Google a while ago but I could not find it. So, yun. Ano pa bang gagawin natin? Yun. Ito turn on pala natin yung uh, heater you guys. Para mamaya pag naligo tayo, hindi ganun masyado malamig. May nakalimutan pala ako ipakita sa inyo guys. Aside from dun sa mga pagkain na bilhin natin, meron pa pala akong isang binili na hindi ko na ipakita sa inyo. Tara! Mga downy you guys Yan Downy daring At ang downy Mystique you guys Kasi guys Ayoko na na nagpa-perfume Yung magsispray-spray pa Gusto ko yung damit itself Mabango na So yun Bumili ako ng madaming Downy Actually guys Gusto ko pang matulog Pero hindi na talaga ako makatulog Hopefully mamaya Konti lang yung pasyente namin Kasi Kapag hindi Patay tayo guys Nakatulog naman tayo I feel like sapat naman yun Pero gusto pa kasi Nakatawan Yun yung problema uh, So I guess Kita na lang tayo mamaya Doon sa hospital Hindi naman ako magvavlog doon Papakita ko lang sa inyo Na nandun ako sa hospital guys uh, Parang ano ba Parang nakacheck in ako na Guys nandito na ako Ganun lang Hindi ako magvavlog doon Ano ba um, Yeah Bukas pala after ng duty na natin from night shift. Pupunta tayo ng dagat, you guys. Titingnan ko lang kasi gusto ko talagang i-try ulit yung swimming na ginawa natin last time. Pagkatapos ng duty, mga 7.30 or 8 o'clock. It depends kung anong oras tayo matapos. Yun lang naman. And, um, yeah. See you sa duty, guys. Bye! Night shift. It has officially started. So, ayan. <clears throat> Remember this face. Kasi mamaya, pagbalik natin in the morning, it's not gonna be like this. Cause tonight is gonna be a dirty night. It's all about bed care. See you guys in the morning. We're gonna take a dip. 7.30. Hopefully, makalabas tayo na maaga from shift. Okay, bye. Hey, hey! Good morning. Good morning, you guys. Kamusta? How are you guys all doing? As you can see, we were able to maintain the hair. May konti nga lang tayong eye bugs, but it's okay. Thankfully, we only had one patient. The ward was not that really busy. And yung patient na iisa is hindi complainant, you guys. He doesn't even complain, even though he's post-operative. Walang complain, you guys. So, all in all, the night was really quiet. A bit gloomy, because what? It's just 7 o'clock later on. Araw na rin yan. And right now, the temperature is at I think 14 or 15 degrees Celsius so it's a bit cold so as promised you guys we're heading to the beach right now yes right now you guys mariligo tayo hopefully matolerate natin I'm just gonna gauge whether I can take it but if not most probably we're not going to but if we can then I'm gonna try but if we cannot then um see you in the beach Ayan guys So we're here Malamig guys Yung kamay ko palang yung nilalabas ko Pero malamig na Kaya ba natin to? <laughs> yung lamig is Ah! Okay <laughs> We made it outside That's the first step So yan we're walking towards the beach na Actually nandito na nga tayo eh. <sighs> So I'm carrying my things with me Dito sa red bag is yung mga damit natin And yung towel And I'm having this uh, big ass gorilla pod Yun I guess we're gonna set up here Lagay lang natin dito yung mga gamit natin
Chill lang kayo. Chill lang kayo, okay? This shoes, guys, it cost me 1,060 dirhams, you guys. And how much is that in the Philippine peso? It depends upon the rate. Maybe if it's 12 dirhams, 1 dirhams is equal to 12 pesos or 13 pesos. It, it, it really depends upon the rate. 12,000 pesos for a shoes? For a white shoes that easily gets dirty? Nasa ng justicia. In <laughs> Hello guys, so now let's review the shoes itself. Focus, so this is the box of the Nike Air Vapor Max Fly Knit 2. You guys, nakita nyo ba? What's inside the box? Ta-da! Let's talk about the pros and cons about buying these shoes. Let's talk about pros, you guys. Oh, nga pala, I'm not a fashion guru or stylist by any means. These are just my opinions, okay? Before we start, let me give you a 360 degree view of the shoes. So let's talk about the pros about buying these white shoes, you guys. Ano nga ba? Ano nga bang advantages about buying a white shoes? Hindi lang ito ah, like a white shoes in general. What are the advantages? So I feel like this is just me, my opinion. A white shoes or a white sneakers literally goes with every single outfit that you could think of. A pants, a shorts, a skirt. It doesn't even matter. Foma wear, semi formal wear, beach wear, street style, gym attire. I feel like these shoes is a good deal. You will feel like kapag nagamit mo siya sa lahat ng attire, you guys, you will feel like even though it's expensive, that, you know, instant gratification na mafe-feel mo na, ah, oh, kahit expensive siya, nagamit ko siya ng sobra. Nakikita niyo ba yung mga pabutas effect, guys, dito sa toes area niya? Then dito rin sa may lateral side ng sapatos na to, madami din siyang pabutas effect. Magkabilaan yan. Meron yan. Yeah, I believe having those holes in these shoes, you guys, will make you feel like your foot is not suffocated. Since yung fit ng anong sapatos na to, as you can see, is on the slimmer side. So if you have a big foot, like you have a long foot, tapos mataba, I feel like may hirapan kang magsuot ng kantong sapatos, guys. Since yung fit ng anya is on the slimmer side, they've added the holes around the shoes to make your foot not feel like it's suffocated. Mm -hmm. Pasensya na guys, nagutom lang. Let's continue. Nagbabalik. <laughs> Yun nga. Since yung fit niya guys, nasa slimmer side, if you have a big foot, it will make your foot a bit slimmer kasi nga makukompress yung paa mo. Itong ang fit niya dito, may parabra effect siya dito sa around ng eye. So yun talaga yung nagpapa... Paano ba explain? It will... So yun na lang. If you have a big foot, Wearing this kind of shoes will slim down your foot and it will make your foot a bit slimmer. So you know one of the advantages. Meron siyang pag-glass effect dito sa ilalim ng paanan niya. I'm not really sure what you call this one. If you guys know, please leave a comment down below. Kasi hindi ko alam. So since you have this glass effect at the bottom of the shoes, you guys, it will give you that illusion that you're a bit taller. You're like an inch taller for some strange reason. It will make your limbs, your lower limbs, an inch longer and it will make you feel like you're taller. So that's a plus for those people na gustong tumangkad pero wala nang chance. So yeah, wala na akong maiisip na advantages you guys. I feel like those are the major 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 advantages of buying these shoes. So this is pretty obvious. Buying a white shoes, of course, it will easily get dirty. Kahit gaano ka pakaingat, na wag madumihan ang iyong white shoes, it will easily get dirty because it's white. It will easily catch dirt and that's a fact. Ano pa ba? Ano pa bang disadvantage ng sapatos na to? Yun, kanina na mention ko dun sa advantage na it will make your foot a bit slimmer, right? In some sense, it's also a disadvantage. Why? Because if you have a fat ass foot, you guys, buying this kind of shoes, since it's on the slimmer side, it will torture or kill the veins of your foot, you guys. If you have a foot like me, hindi siya ganun kahaba, pero mataba siya, guys. Mataba. Buying this kind of shoes is, I feel like, a bad idea. Cause, yes, 
Pwede mo lang siyang gamitin pag gusto mong mag-photoshoot, photoshoot, or gusto mong pumorma, porma. Pero kung gusto mo siyang gamitin, guys, sa lakaran, hindi pwede. Kasi na-try ko na siyang ilakad, guys. Maganda nga siya tingnan, pero ayun, tiis pogi ang dating this. Kanina na-mention ko din na since madami siyang pabutas effect dito sa may toes area niya, then dito sa may lateral side ng sapatos, it will make your foot like it's on air, right? But... It's also a disadvantage. Alam mo kung bakit? Since madami nga siyang pabutas effect dyan, guys, madaling pasok ka ng tubig. So, madaling mabasa ang pa mo. So, disadvantage. Ano pa ba? Ano pa bang disadvantage? Ah, alam ko na. Magiging antisocial ka. Since na-mention din natin kaganina na madali siyang madumihan, guys, syempre, kapag nasa public ka, ayaw mo siyang matapakan. Ayaw, ayaw mo siyang matapakan. Ni ayaw mo makikalubin sa ibang tao. Papapak. Mapapaganon ka guys! Antisocial! Disadvantage yan! Ano pa ba? Ano pa ba ang disadvantage mo? Ano pa ba? Ah! Nako! Prone ka sa kidnapping! Since na 12,000 nga itong sapatos mo! Disadvantage! Disadvantage! Makikidnap ka! Ay na! So, I guess yun lang yung advantages and disadvantages ng sapatos na to. Wala na ako maisip to. Yes, maganda siya guys. Maganda siya. It really looks good. It will make you feel like ang ganda mo tingnan kapag nakasuot ka ng sapatos na ganito. But at the same time, meron siyang disadvantages. Maganda nga siya tingnan. Masakit naman sa paa. Yun lang guys. Those are my advantages and disadvantages. I guess this is my review for the shoes. Tingnan ko pa ang dami ko sinasabi, no?